Hello, Square Balls 5 Themes 5 here in game names, Mr. Sal Z. I'm back in Minecraft with another build. Well, it's technically the same build as last time, but it's like the continuation of it. It's episode 3 of it, it's the dwarf build. And I'll turn in a sec, a little bit of surprise. There's a bridge that I added in just to sort of separate it. But um, I was thinking, you know, I was doing stalls and more houses and stuff and bridges, but then I just stopped and thought, oh, I'm. Um, I'm in the mood for enchantments, like dwarfs, they are really good at mining, I could, I could, I was trying to think of a reason to maybe try and explain why they would be, and I thought, oh, maybe they had like really good enchanted picks, and I thought, oh, yeah, all of a sudden you add in some enchantment tables somewhere, and I thought, where would an enchantment table be, and instantly I thought, a church, or something like that, and I thought, alright, let's build something small and simple, just plot one in, and I came up with this son of a bitch here. Bloody hell, it's one of the most freaking annoying things to build of everything I've built. I literally just finished, haven't done anything around it, like the path or like the gardens or anything. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be putting gardens around it. Um I couldn't find a better spot, so I just put it next to the windmill <laughs> and somehow it's like that populated bit there, I just thought it'd be good. Uh this'll come out. Let's see it paths will come out like there and I'll round it off so it'll start about here and bring it around just quickly do this oh. so it's took just under an hour I'd say to do this thing took ages oh well oh well indeed I haven't done inside yet but the roof it's from the design, you know, the curved sort of roof, you know, the sort of house designs they used to do. I'll just show you. So yeah, that's the path that's come out there. Um, circle and show you. Try to make it look sort of, you know, match the town as much as possible. I don't know if I've done it. Right, I was trying to think maybe I should add some white wool and I thought, Ugh, look a bit tacky on a church like this. Like, I try to add as much bright materials as possible, like the wood and the stone slabs, and I just look stupid enough with that. But I thought I might as well just keep it in because it's bright and I need that for this sort of design of town. It's a dwarf town. Um, so I'm just trying to picture myself, just someone coming on the server, just walking about and seeing, I'm just trying to see what they, you know, think is cool. I thought, oh, church. I do like this windmill that I made. Not much inside it yet. Just like a big room, I need to make a way up. That'd be good. Actually, oh yeah, never mind. I thought I hadn't made a path around, but I did. Um, trying to make the paths more sort of civilized, not as like messy and stuff. You know what I mean? Like, you know, there isn't really much of a path right now. It's just crazy. It's just all stone brick. Over there, I've done it a bit more. See, I've got grass added in. Oh yeah, here's the stalls and the bridge that I added in. So I put in a few more houses, but uh, we got see we've got cake, we've got cake, and we've got another cake, and um, not really a way up to this bridge yet. I could, yeah, screw. It, I'm gonna connect it to this path. I'll just do that. Yeah. Um, got a while to go, I guess, till this place is finished. Long time to go indeed. Also, I'm gonna have to make some more mining bits because it's freaking dwarfs. They love mining. I love mining indeed. But what I've got so far in these hills is nowhere near enough not for dwarfs. Now. I'm thinking of making a huge underground. Just, just making most of the rest of the city or town, whatever, underground. This thing is going to be huge. Like proper huge. It's gonna be very really big. Oh no! 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 Yes. There we go. <sighs> very big. It's gonna be. If you watch my dwarf city build, um, that's an underground one mostly. <laughs> it's not. You could argue it's in there, it isn't much of a city because it isn't that much houses and stuff like that, but that was on the video. After the video, I went on it and I put a hell load of stuff on it. Like, um, houses built onto the side of the, inside of the 
on the ground and hell and stuff. It looks a lot better, but um, obviously I'm going to be making, I might make houses on the side of the hill here. And I'm thinking of maybe taking that statue down and turning it around maybe so it's facing that way. Don't know though, I'm maybe putting one outside the church, I'm not sure. Or inside, ah, inside the church, that's quite sexy. That'd be nice, I'm going to go and look for a room. Or maybe underground, I don't know. I'm not underground bit I was talking about. I might connect the underground bit to the hills or maybe... Because obviously, I said before, I'm going to be taking up all this land. All this land is going to be claimed by the wares. The wares. Holy mother of goodness gracious of slacker money on it. There we go. Better turn this down just a wee bitty witty titty. Now, let's see. This is what I've got in here. As you can see, I've definitely put another interior. Ugh. Gonna make rooms in here with bells in it or something going up. Um, but for this video, for what I've done, that's pretty much <coughs> it, I guess. <laughs> I haven't done too much this time, just stalls, the wee fishing, fishy bits, bridge. Yes, yeah, so that's a bridge and the church. It's got to be the biggest one of this update on the dwarf town. But all in all, I think it's coming along well. It's looking, not looking terrible, to be honest. I, find it, I don't know, it just looks like a proper town now. It just looks at, like something people in Minecraft testificates would live in. Oh, that's a good idea, actually. <laughs> I might get the NPC mod. I don't know. That would be cool. And I'd have like shopkeepers, guards, freaking priests, and some sort of army. Uh, oh no, they'd have to be dwarves, wouldn't they? Balls. Hmm. I wonder if you get like dwarf NPCs. Like a mod to make, like. <gasps> I wonder if I get, there's like a mod that can make me smaller. Like me like a dwarf. That'd be freaking awesome. I'd like that. And okay, my legs go away and it's just me, like, just walking about. Like, ha oh. ha. Oh no! There we go. I'm just gonna walk about the place spawning in a lot of people's. Oh god, this is hard. <laughs> Should I put one in? Nah, I'll destroy the wheat. Put some up in the bridge, and I'll put one up in the statue. Eh! <laughs> That's me. <laughs> this is me populating my town with creepy. Oh my god, it's not so creepy to look at my texture pack. Oh no, my god. Go. Anyway, so that's pretty much it. So, um, <coughs> thanks for watching. A time to, uh, maybe leave us a wee like, comment, and another purpose for this video is I need subscribers. I really need subscribers, you know. I'm kind of low on them right now. 29 at the moment. Uh, <laughs> isn't too much, I guess. I appreciate the people I've subscribed, but it isn't really that much. So thank you to who have, but if you already have, please maybe subscribe if you enjoy my videos and you want to keep up to date with them. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching and uh, goodbye!